hello guys this is Jaydeep Kalkani and welcome back to another tutorial of simplified programming so as you can see on the screen this is the project which we have created in our previous video tutorial so in this tutorial what we are going to do we are going to make an android application in which the android screen shows one text view like this and below this text view we have one button when the user clicks this button text is going to be changed so if you don't have the basic knowledge about android programming using java then i strongly recommend you to learn about the basic of the android programming using java and come back to our tutorials so let's get started without wasting time let's create a new project click on file then new then new project I am going to give the name second demo project. You can give as you want. So click next. Then here select the minimum Android version on which you want to run your app. So I am going to select 4.0.3 version which covers almost 100% of devices so click next and here select the empty activity and click next here don't touch any settings and click finish button so our project is created here we are using android studio 2.3.3 so the android studio will uh, create an activity by default with the java file main activity dot java and these tutorials are about the kotlin language so simply press the shift key twice and convert this java code into the kotlin so for that search java to kotlin you will find this option convert java file to kotlin file click on this option this will convert your java code into the kotlin code automatically here our code is converted into the kotlin code and our file is also converted into the kotlin file main activity dot kt now if uh, it asks you for uh, configure the kotlin then simply configure the kotlin as we have configured in the previous video tutorial let's get started development of our android application so first of all let's create our user interface click on the activity main.xml file and here you can see that we have one text view first of all i suggest you to change this uh, layout to relative layout so relative layout I again recommend you that you don't have the basic knowledge about Android programming using Java. Then uh, learn it and come back to our video tutorials. By the way, change this text from hello world to hello Jaydeep. Okay. And uh, one important thing is that uh, in every element you must have to give the ID because we are going to pointing the element by using that id so i am giving the id my text view and here we want to keep it to the center horizontal so one property of this is center horizontal and keep it to true so it will centralize and let me space it from the top so margin top 50 dp okay and uh, let me increase the size of text text size keep it 35 dp okay now create one button below this text view so create the button button keep the width wrap content and height also wrap content and uh, write the text in this button uh, change text okay 
because we are going to change this text by clicking this button. Give this button ID. ID. I am giving ID my button. Okay. And keep it into the center horizontal true. And put it below the text view. So its one property is below layout plus ID. Our text view ID is my text view. So my text view. Here our button is below the text view. And uh, keep the margin top 10 dp. So it's look pretty. Okay, we have done with our user interface and let's get to the actual logic of our program. What we are going to do is user clicks this button, we are going to change this text hello Jaydeep to hello Kalkani. So in the Kotlin file, we have to uh, refer the button ID, we have to refer the button ID my button and set uh, the on click listener on this. So for referring that we have to write my button but in Kotlin if we write the my button directly it will not identify your button. So for that we have to import the Kotlin extensions dependency. Go into the app level gradle file and copy this line and paste it below. And at the end write this extensions. Okay. This will simply show that synchronize the project because you make changes into the Gradle file. So synchronize it. After synchronization completed, get back to the main activity.kt file. Here import the package import Kotlin X dot Android dot synthetic dot main dot your activity name here our activity name is activity main dot xml so we can write activity main and write dot star dot star means that it will import all the uh, layouts from this uh, xml file so now we can uh, refer our button write my b and control space then it will show you suggestions my button then click on it dot set on click listener uh, press control space to see the suggestions uh, on click listener then here we can write our body of code so what we have to do when the user clicks the button we have to change the text uh, here so we have to refer this text view by using this id my text view so here write my text view dot set text because we want to set the text in the text box it is the method by using which we can set the text of the text view here what we have to set hello kalkani ok our application is completed so now run our code for running the code start your avd i am starting my android virtual device from here Starting AVD. So now my Android virtual device is started. Now let's run our app. So click on the debug button or run button and select your android virtual device and click ok first time gradle build running takes lot more time but after then it will take less time so if it happens with you that it takes longer then don't cancel it wait for it so now our application is running on our android virtual device As we can see in preview, our Android application shows the hello Jaydeep text and change text button. As I click the change text button, it is changed to the hello Kalkani. So 
let's click again the button I clicked again this button but nothing happens so your today's homework is that as user clicks first time this button the text is changing to hello kalkani as user clicks second time the button then uh, text should be changed to the hello chaydeep so it should be toggle from hello chaydeep to hello kalkani and hello kalkani to hello chaydeep and you can find all this code on my github repository and the link is given below in the description so that's all for this tutorial guys we will meet next tutorial see you